Okay, in this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can take a normal digital photo and turn it into an old vintage looking photo that you can use in your scrapbooking projects. And I will be using Photoshop Elements 7.0 to do this. It's actually quite easy. There's only a few steps you need to do. So what I have here is a picture that was actually taken by of my son down in Universal Studios in Florida and he's it looks like it's an old uh, taxi cab and he's kind of standing there saying telling it to halt so what I want to do because the background and everything is kind of older I'm gonna kind of turn this into an old vintage photo and what I want to do is the first thing I'm gonna do is go over to my effects palette and I'm going to choose the photo effects button and on the right during the drop down I'm gonna go and I'm gonna choose monotone color and I'm gonna choose the tint sepia option and I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to drag that over to the photograph and as you can see it now changed it to a uh, it's not a black and white but it has that sepia tone look to it and what I want to do now I could just leave it like that but I want to add a little bit more effect to it to give a little more vintage look so what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new layer on top of the uh, the sepia tone looking layer and I'm going to go over to my color swatches I'm going to click on the foreground color and I'm going to go and choose a kind of a tan color, a light tan. I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to go up to Filter, down to Render, and Clouds. And as you can see, it now covered the this layer with the uh, kind of, it almost looks kind of like a parchment paper. And what I want to do now is go to that same layer. And I'm going to select Multiply. And then there we have, we actually have a photo that looks even more vintage, it actually kind of looks uh, worn in and, you know, had some sunspots and, and just basically aged, uh, an aged look to it. And that's uh, all there is to it. You can, within a few steps, a few seconds, you can go and create a vintage looking old fashioned photo from any of your uh, current digital photos that you can add to your scrapbooking projects. For all of your scrapbooking needs, check out www.scrapbookingsuppliesandmore.com.